Hi guys, as some of you have already noticed, when we released the JavaScript version of Checker and added features for coding teachers, we fell behind on creating mission on the game. Now it's time to bring it back. In order to create your missions on Checker, you need to have access to the missions dashboard, which means you should be either at level 9 or if you have a good mission ideas, just send me a message and I give you an access. Here is how it works. Use pip to install Checker Task Tester tool, and it is better to use Python 3 by the way. During the first launch you will have to install a testing key. It will be used for Checker server communication. You can get a key on the mission dashboard. Now create a mission in folder My New Mission. The tester tool created a folder and all necessary files into this folder. All you have left to do is to edit those files. Launch the tester tool again, but this time with only one argument. Path to the mission folder we want to test. The last step is to open the mission URL and check how it looks. All the changes will be applied immediately, you only need to refresh the page. That's it. We can also use the tester with already created checker mission. At the bottom of every mission you can find a link to a git repository. Ok, now let me show you what is inside of the mission folder. We have seen task description HTML already. Task short description HTML contains a very short description of the mission and it will be shown on a station page. Media contains all the images of mission description. In order to link them, we are using a special media graph. Speaking of special cases, right now Checker supports two programming languages for solving coding puzzles, Python and JavaScript. Both of those languages are using the same repository. Using ifdag, we can separate different code examples for different languages. Initial code in editor folder contains initial codes for different languages. Animation is responsible for showing results to you. You may need to change the several options here, which we will get back to later. The last main folder I want to cover here before we go through the actual practical cases is verification. Here you can find all the scripts that test your code. For every pipe, the main testing can change. On the current level, you just want to change only several options here. TestPy contains all the tests and you will definitely change this file. That's it for showing the basic structure of mission folder. Let's maybe create one more simple mission where you need to find how many times one string can be found in an hour string. Let's first change a mission description with a couple examples here. We should describe an input and output parameters, but I will try to do everything very briefly.
Now let's change our initial code of JavaScript and both Python version. Copy our function names into animation and verification form. The last step is creating tests. Let's test how it works now. Now the mission is ready to be published on Checker. We should make a public Git repository for it. Here's your, your URL. You can use it to publish your new mission on GitHub. After refreshing page, you will find your mission folder published on GitHub. Now you should use HTTPS URL to show mission to checker. That's pretty much it. Don't forget to share your new mission to community of authors.
Now if you want to update your mission after it has been shared, you can easily update the mission through the GitHub interface and click Sync button in Checkout dashboard. You can also go to your local folder. Common JIT pool will get all the rest recent changes. As you can see, all the changes are applied. Thank you and see you on checkout.